Hello, um, I'm a midwife at an NHS hospital and I would recommend hypnobirthing to anybody that's looking for basically a way to keep calm and to keep relaxed and to keep sort of in control and to really think about the decisions and the choices that they've got available to them. Well, the first time I came across hypnobirthing I was working on a labour ward and I saw mom, one mum come in hypnobirthing she absolutely, it just blew me away it just made me realise there's another way to, to birth and have your baby really she was really calm, really relaxed um, and really sort of went within herself and had a really easy birth and I thought that's definitely the way to do it not just all this fear, tension, pain, really tensing up um, she was just very calm and very still actually and I knew that she was just getting on with it and her body was just taking over and, she, and just doing it for her really she actually put her mind aside and, and, she, and she was just doing it it was wonderful and I thought that's it, I've got to go and do the training and then help other mums to birth in that way and I found like my partner at the beginning when I said that I was going to do hypnobirthing he was a bit sort of um, wow he just thought it was a load of rubbish and that I was... <laughs> Doing, doing something that was costing, you know, money and that wasn't going to actually be of any use. But he is now like a convert, and he would recommend doing um, hypnobirthing and having a, a home birth. I think the first hypnobirth I saw, like many midwives, I didn't believe myself that the lady was gone. It was sort of progressed as far as she wanted to, and I was fairly newly qualified as a midwife, so I had to get a senior midwife in to say. <laughs> I think she's doing really well, but could you just check this? And and she was, and it was within, within an hour she had gone from just walking in to birthing her baby, and then that's when I thought, oh, there's something in this. I didn't have a very long labour. I think it was probably about, it was maybe five hours tops, um, but I wasn't really counting, because as a midwife I thought that I might be quite... I don't know, sort of, on the counting of the contractions and everything, but I wasn't at all. And I think, um, you know that zone of being relaxed that you get into? I was in that zone. For also loving hypnobirthing, it just seems that the dads have a role to play, which is really, I think, sometimes they just don't know what they're doing, they sit there and that can be either they get a bit angry or they get a bit anxious or a bit nervous, leave the room, but it just seems there's a real tight bond with any hypnobirthing labouring women um, and their partner and that they can actually really help them all the way through rather than feel like they're a spare part in the room. Um, blocking out the light from the living room window and um, helping me set up the pool and things. And he got in the pool with me and he was amazing. He held Arthur's head as he was coming out. Just the whole preparation that hypnobirthing give the, gives the women, they know what's coming next, they're not scared of it, so they don't go fall down the cycle of the fear and the tension. I've really enjoyed it and I, I actually felt really sad that it was all over and for days after, weeks and months after, I still think about it. Um, I just can't wait to do it again. Much more calm throughout, even if things aren't weren't exactly as planned. And I think that's really the, the empowerment they get yeah. from that is it's just great. absolutely amazing. Absolutely, if they're making an informed decision, they stay in control. Their baby, their labour, their birth, they stay in control. And then if it does go down the route of the intervention, obviously you want. Um, um, healthy baby, healthy mum, and positive birth experience. With hypnobirthing, I have to say, all the mums and the couples that I've taught have had really positive experiences, uh, no matter what the you know the outcome has been. As a midwife, I've seen lots of women in labour, and I think what hypnobirthing gives you is that belief and that confidence in your body's ability to be able to give birth. Um, naturally without any help and that actually you're the one that knows best um, you know what's what's going on with you and I think I'd recommend it to anybody whatever sort of birth you choose to have whether it's at home whether it's an elective cesarean whether it's going into hospital or a birth center whatever because um, I think 
it just it's about listening to your own instincts getting into a sort of a, a really positive state of mind about um, having your baby the term hypnobirthing can put some people off but hypnobirthing is just deep relaxation that's all it is nothing much more to it than that is there no and the, the basics of it go back to the basics of midwifery giving the woman time to listen to her body um, living, giving her the confidence to believe in herself that she can do it. It's not, not under a spell. It's nothing. Um, nothing weird about it. No, it's nothing hippie or weird about it at all. 